Well, there is some activity out there for the state, but for us here in the Contra Valley, we're getting our first day of a break from rain chances. You probably look out west, see some clouds starting to form out towards Midland, just outside of Crockett County as well, along I-10, quite a bit of some strong storms, but those are not going to be getting to us. We're just going to be seeing it stay dry and, of course, staying warm. 93 is what we got to today. It was a nice warm start. We got to 76, a little bit on that humid side, and we are going to watch some of those clouds help with a nice sunset. You guys already start to see some of those high-level clouds out there for us and continue into the evening. 91 here in downtown. The breeze is something to watch for the rest of our week and into the weekend because it's going to stay pretty strong, 10 to 15 miles per hour. 92 here in Tom Green County. We're seeing 94 towards Ballinger, 93 towards Coleman. So low 90s for most and some getting to what's going to be pretty consistent of the mid 90s for Mason in junction at 94 and 93. And our humidity, that's a little on the upside, but not too bad. We'll see it increase as we go into tonight and start out tomorrow morning. And continuing with us is our breeze, 10 to 15 miles per hour out of the south. We are going to see some gusts that are going to get a little bit stronger than that. So tomorrow morning to start out, we're going to hit 72, warming up into the mid-90s, 93. Plenty of sunshine, a nice breeze from the south. It's going to be pretty much like how it was today, continue that tomorrow, and continuing into the weekend as well. As you can see, some of us getting just above 15. We're seeing some 18-mile-per-hour winds, gusts that could get up to 20 miles per hour. That continues into Saturday and Sunday, all coming in from the south. It'll help give us a nice break from the mid-90s and all the sunshine that's coming in for the next several days because we see no big major changes that are coming our way for the Contra Valley, both at the surface and in the upper atmosphere. We actually see this upper atmosphere ridge and high pressure that sits over us, so it's not going to build in a lot of hot temperatures. The hotter temperatures are going to be out towards our west, but for us, mid-90s, and usually we're sitting at 97, seeing more of the upper 90s getting closer to triple digits, but not this weekend and not this week either. So it is going to be a very quiet weather pattern for the next several days. And we're just, of course, going to be watching when we see our next rain chances. But that is going to be a while because it is going to be drying out for tomorrow. And we see 93, 95 Saturday and Sunday. We see 94, 96, and that's how it stays. Even our overnight lows are staying pretty consistent with low 70s. Plenty of sunshine. And, of course, we want to watch that breeze of 10 to 15 miles per hour from the south with gusts that could get to 20 miles per hour. So windy, but it is going to feel nice with those mid-90s on the weekend.